relationship you were on the field with the 12 men. Do, do you know what happened there? Did you guys come out of timeout just a miscommunication or what happened on that? Oh yeah, definitely miscommunication. You know, not much we can do about that. Definitely, uh, we take the blame as a defense, you know, because if, if that wouldn't happen, then that field goal would just gave our offense a shot. But everything's new right now. You know, we're learning, and it's definitely a different vibe in the locker room. You know, we can go in the tank, and uh, we're definitely ready to get uh, going next week. After the second quarter, what was the message from the coaching staff as you guys headed into halftime? You actually did pretty well in the second half. But. Uh, just tackle the player, but that was about it. Uh, we definitely some learning experience, you know. Uh, we didn't take this as a loss, we took this as a, a learning experience. You know, we made a lot of mistakes, but at the end of the day, everything that happened today was already scripted out, and we can't uh, control the uncontrollables, and we're just ready to get going for next week. How much did you guys know about uh, Cincinnati's backup quarterback going into this game? Uh, you know, we get the uh, personnel type of thing each and every week, but uh, each and every day we uh, we expect the starter to play, you know, the starter went out. Hope he's great, you know, hope he's in uh, high spirits. Uh, he's in my prayers, and uh, we know too much about the uh, back quarterback that was a runner, but he's a, uh, he's a great player, and uh, <coughs> hats off to him. Over here, on your, on your right. Uh, what do you think of Dorian, and um, well, how good do you think he could be if kind of Given more game reps, uh, uh, Dorian's definitely a, a god fearing man. You know he's built different. You know uh, coming in, you know he had a chip on his shoulder. And he uh, he didn't come off with a, a negative vibe. So Dorian's definitely somebody that I look up to. You know he's going to be. Hopefully, I pray that Wilson get this in the high spirits. You know I hope that he's, his results are where they're supposed to be at. You know, but we just got to keep things rolling. You know Wilson's in my prayers. Dorian's in my prayers. You know. Uh, I know as a freshman, he definitely felt like it was his fault that we probably lost tonight, but he definitely should think in that type of way if he does things like that. The fact that you guys were able to put so much pressure on the first quarterback, how much does that make you feel in turn, when you play drive back quarterbacks that you'll be able to have that same type of thing? Say that again? You had such a good you had such good luck against the first quarterback rushing the passer and putting pressure on him. How much confidence does that give you the next time you play a drive back passer that you'll be able to uh, we're just gonna play our game. We're just gonna play our game no matter who the quarterback is. You know, that's the way we're built. You know, we uh, prepare each and every week. So whoever's going out there, we're gonna be ready for them.